time. What's this? Boulder. Oh, they spelled it that way. Oh, bit hipster, bit hipster boulder. So they're going to be a glass fronted gelato bar. Right, so here we are. We're off to Limington in the uh, New Forest. It's going to be a long ride, this one. Oh yeah, I should just do fun facts as I cycle along. Oh, well, fun f <laughs> planning permission fact. They're going to build about, what, a thousand homes on the, uh, the field to my right. But yeah, it's going to be a huge thing. I think it's playing fields at the moment. Match day. It's a Saturday. <gasps> so we're going past um, Eastley Football Club. They're in the, uh, the conference south, I think. All bikes and buses only, good. Oh, that's quite scary. I thought it was a kid crossing. So it works. That's quite, yeah. Because you're used to recognizing shapes. So shape of a child outside of school seems quite normal. Oh, traffic. Yeah. Off the main road, down here. Cycle shared path thing. Oh, wheelie chair. Cyclist dismount, what? No. There you go, I can hear the main road. So we're not far off. Oh, there you are. There's some, oh, some painful speed bumps there. Ugh. Right, we're going to try and sneak around the side of this one. Yeah, loads easier. The roundabout, great. Uh, 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 I've ended up in Tesco's. What? What? Tesco's? I don't want to. What? That was a bit of a curveball. Um, uh, well, this is Tesco's. Okay, well, that was a very weird detour. So hopefully this doesn't just chuck me onto the dual carriageway, because there's a dual carriageway to get to the New Forest, but I don't really want to be on there on my bike. I don't want to end up on this, do I? Well, no, I can't. Like, I'd love to do this roundabout, but no. Not if it just goes on to the dual carriageway. Like, I'd love to do dual carriageway, but can't be on a road that does like 60. Cyclist to Redbridge, there we go. Redbridge is on the way. Fun fact about Redbridge, some sources say it used to be called Reed Bridge because there's loads of reeds. And then over time, it just got squished into Redbridge because the bridge isn't actually red and never was red. That's right, down. Oh, you never really see a down arrow actually on a road sign. <laughs> Oh, wow, are they building a cycle lane? Yeah, they are. Wow. Why is that not being publicised? Oh, this is it. This is the bridge, isn't it? This is Red Bridge. See, it's not red at all. Concrete, monstrosity. There go, look. I don't know what you can see. I just see ugliness. It's just industrial wasteland, really, isn't it? Bit noisy, bit smelly. Ealing Marchwood, nah. So Ealing has a tide mill. Fun fact, I think Ealing Tide Mill is one of the last fully functional tide mills. Oh, I can just smell petrol fumes. Ugh. Not a nice smell. Flashbacks to London and Oxford Street. Air is so much cleaner in Southampton. 236, take a right onto the road, yeah. I'm getting better at my mountain bike hops now. Cycles crossing. Wait, what? But I'm a cycle. Am I crossing? Ah, see. Oh, this is lovely. You know, this is quite nice because we're covering miles without being stressed, in danger, or tired or thirsty. It's like cruising on the motorway. There's a pub called the New Forest. So I think we are in the New Forest. We're definitely in the New Forest now. Looks like a forest. Yeah, that's a forest. Don't know how old it is though. There you go, the New Forest. Might get to see some horses and cattle grids. Cattle grids on a bike. Wait. Don't think I've done a cattle grid. As long as I don't turn, it's gonna be bumpy. Ah, uh, that was very weird. Oh, I see some cows. Cows! Cows in a field, eating some grass. Oh, we're getting some closer action to the cows. There we go. Got a cow, a light brown cow, eating some grass there. We've got some horses. <gasps> oh, horses! Oh, little munching in their grass. Oh. All right, I, I see why people come to the new forest now, to see horses and cows. All right, another cattle grid. <laughs> Oh, there's a tour bus. There's a tour. There's a double-decker tour bus. We're going through the new forest. Oh, that's great. See, not just London, countryside as well. I really didn't know they did that. Look at all these houses with slow broadband. Oh, this is what a village looks like. Forgot villages exist. Oh, that one rattled. That one. Look, yeah. Countryside. This is it. Trees and grass. Two miles to Lindhurst on a road like this. Great. Well, we had to have some of this. I expected some of this. Countryside traffic. Haven't really encountered this before. 
a bit bumpy. Oh yeah, countryside traffic. This is more fun than city traffic actually. There are cat eyes, gotta dodge the cat eyes. Oh, this is great. All this traffic, I'm losing count of how many cars I've overtaken. Oh my goodness, look at that. I have to say it is a Saturday, at the end of July. Oh, this is loads of fun. I'm glad I made the trip. This is worth the whole trip. This, oh my gosh, this is brilliant. Oh, this is great. The best way to start your holiday is cycling past traffic. Oh, and this is Lyndhurst. A lovely little town in the new forest. Please sirens. In the new forest. Oh, traffic. Brilliant. Oh, we're stuck behind horses. Oh. Yeah, so I guess I can cycle quicker than a horse. This is Brockenhurst. Another little village. Very villagey. There you go, the village pub. The village shop. The village level crossing. The village kebab shop. The village B&B. The village fancy coffee shop. Village fire station. The village bike shop. The village thatched roof house. It's got everything a village needs. Car wash for all the massive Range Rovers. Right, actually, fair enough. If you live here, that's that's a normal thing to have in the New Forest. Can't complain about them. This is their natural habitat. The natural habitat of the Range Rover. But there's a song I listen to, and it's like one of the lyrics is, "I've never ridden my bike down to the sea," and that got me thinking. I I haven't ridden my bike down to the sea. This is me following my dreams. These roads are really bumpy though. I can't handle it. Whoa. Whoa. There's like pure petrol coming out the back of his car. Woo! That can't be good. It's the size of a small ship, that car. Horse manure. 30 pence a bag. Ice. Ice ahead. Why is it saying ice ahead? It's the end of July. Ice. Oh, okay. Careful of the ice, people. Ice ahead. Haven't spotted any ice yet. I'd really like some ice now. Oh, this is lovely. Oh, wow. I see the Isle of Wight. Oh, wow. Lovely little village square here. Oh, it's seasidey. Smells like seaweed. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where's the sea? Oh, here we go. Seaside. Look, I see boats. Now it's time to cycle home. Like, my vision is struggling because everything is vibrating on this road. Oh, it's actually going down. Oh, it's weird seeing the wheels. Oh, oh. Uh, they overtake some cars, why not? It's just standstill, what is this? Oh, they've got bunting, see? Every village needs bunting. Coming back into Southampton. Goodbye, New Forest. Ah, there we go, yeah. The ruined boot. Ruined, ruined boot. I don't know what accent that is. Ruined boot. Ruined boot. Ruined boot. Why did I say ruined boot? Ruined boot. Ruined boot. Ruined boot. Ruined. That's Scottish, I think, isn't it? Ruined. Ruined boot. Who knows? Oh, drive through. Ah, oh. yeah, I think they'd tell me off if I drive through on my bike. Eh, I could try it one day if it's not busy. No harm in trying. Cut through Tesco's again. I mean, it worked. Don't need petrol, whoa, whoa, don't need petrol. So here I've got to thread the needle of the wheel through that little gap there. Okay. This is properly testing of my uh, bike handling skills. Fire engines. Oh, missed the uh, fire engine. Oh. oh, so this is Shirley High Street. Welcome. Pigeon. Well done. You made the right choice. With no traffic lights for the shared use cycle path. Here we've got a roundabout and the Spitfire on it. Because Spitfires used to be built here. It's Southampton Airport. Go down this little road here. Doncaster Road. Wait. Don... Cast... Doncaster. Ah. That's weird. Because in a southern accent, I should say Doncaster. Ooh.